What is going on there guys, Kempi here and welcome back to the Wrexham save and today I'm actually going to be ending the Wrexham save but I have gone through and I've played through the whole season but I want to give you guys the save to finish over. Now I know we've done this once already and to be honest I feel really bad for doing it again but if I want to see myself, the content I really enjoy recording at the moment is the tactic content, is the rebuild content, and I'm absolutely loving streaming. Um, as you can tell, I probably put a lot of work into the stream with the whole setup we've got going on. Um, and I actually really, really enjoy it. And I get my Let's Play match engine kick from that. Um, to be honest, I don't enjoy the match engine quite as much as I used to, and I find playing the game a little bit tedious. Um, so playing actual gameplay side of things... I can't do two seasons at well, two sort of saves at once. And to be honest, I much more enjoy making the YouTube content of rebuild and tactics than I do making this type of content. So that is why today we are going to be finishing off the Wrexham save. Now, as you can see from the results on screen, we have come second in the league. We are promoted back into the Premier League, and that is exactly what we wanted at the start of this season. Regardless of where you know our, our views were for after this season, Getting promoted back to the Premier League was the big thing. And Emilio Torone and Rian Brewster really helped us make that a reality. You've got an amazing team here at Wrexham. The team is fantastic. There's lots of good players here. Obviously, a few leaving to go back out on loan. But, I mean, the loan system you've got yourself is also fantastic. You've got Leo coming back, who's going to be happy you're back in the big time. You've got Sinta Milovac back, who I really like and we just signed. Um, he looks fantastic. You've got Mason, Van Vold, Brodovic, uh, Earl Rowe. There's some really good youngsters. Uh, the youth intake was absolutely useless this year, so there's no one new there. But you've still got Vuk Topic, Nathan Monk, uh, Sylvester Chindo is still around at the club as well. And you've also got £40 million pounds and £115,000 wage-wise as well. So money is not an issue here at Wrexham anymore. Finances-wise, we have got the club properly into the big time. I mean, we started three years prior to this, and this is even sort of a League One season. And we're looking at like, that looks to me like five or six million pounds, but you can see we spiked right up to 98 million pounds. And right now we're sitting on 34 million pounds. And we've done very well financially. We have set Wrexham up to be a very, very good club. You've got a team that, you know, there's a massive story in real life about them. And there's a story on the game too. And I hope you guys are happy with where we're finishing. And this is going to be officially the end. We're not going to come back to Wrexham ever again. This is it. We're, we're done here. This is kaput. Wrexham is over. But it has been a journey. It's been a journey I've really liked as well. Um, it's one that, you know, has sort of taken my sort of YouTube dream to sort of another level, to be honest. I mean, there was no way six months ago I even dream would be on 680 or 660 subs and featured in Omega, Omega Luke videos. And, you know, I'm now on Twitch and I'm affiliate. And this Wrexham save really was sort of the birth of that. So it's quite... Uh, a weird, surreal feeling to be finishing it. But I think it's definitely time to finish it. If you look at the views on the channel and, you know, I, I'm not all about the views because honestly, it's what I enjoy making more. But the views themselves as well, we can get four, five, six, seven times more views on a, on a rebuild and a tactic video. And like I say, I'm not even in it for the views. I'm in it for the enjoyment. And I get a lot of enjoyment out of doing the stream saves. I feel like it's instant feedback. And I feel like you guys enjoy watching it more as well over on Twitch. There's a possibility, depending on what happens with my personal life, that... If I have the time to, we'll be making some stream highlights videos, but they won't be sort of a schedule. There is going to be a brand new schedule of the channel coming out on Saturday. Trust me, I'm not keeping it to just one rebuild and one tactic video a week. Simply not enough of that to go around. But we are going to be doing a lot of stuff on the channel. Back to pretty much daily videos, including shorts and TikToks. So, yeah, it's going to be good fun. We're going to bring that all out tomorrow. But I wanted to sort of do this video here today to finish off the Wrexham save, finish off the story that is Wrexham. And I'll be putting a save file link into the Discord channel. Um, so if you're on the Discord already, that'll be in the save tactics bit there. And you can pick this up if you're brand new as well. Just simply head down to the description, hop over to the Discord, just join in. It's, it's great fun. We have a lot of chat in there as well, and it's always good. So you get notifications when every video goes live and everything like that as well. So yeah, I massively thank you. I'm a massive Wrexham fan now, up the Wrexham. Um, but sadly, it is the end. I hope you guys do not mind. If you are here for the, the Let's Play content, it is going to be slowing down a lot. So I understand if you do, go ahead and unsubscribe. But I'd rather you stick around and make a lot of tactics videos, a lot of rebuilds as well. And they are great fun. So make sure to stick around for them. If you can, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Maybe comment down below in this nostalgic moment of what your favourite Wrexham journey, sort of the Wrexham story was. What, what bit did you like the most? Um, for me... It's got to be the story of Paul Mullen. I mean, there are three or four seasons where he got over 50 goals. The guy's a legend. And it was sad the way it ended with him. But Paul Mullen taking us back to the championship, that's quite special for me. So thank you guys for watching. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I'll speak to you next time.